looks like a giant wrinkly potato. Hi everybody, I'm Tim Wong. I'm a senior biologist here at the Steinhardt Aquarium. Today we're looking at something pretty special. We actually have our quorum of our corpse flower, Mirage, a Morphophallus titanum. Mirage actually bloomed for us a little over a year ago and she recently went dormant. Um, you can see this is actually what the corpse flower grows from. So it's a modified stem that stores all that energy similar to that of a bulb. So today we're gonna wait and see how much this corn weighs. We can see the weight here now is about 37 pounds. 2020, when we moved this plant into the rainforest, it was actually 25 pounds, so it's a bit bigger. They can get up to 100 pounds or even more, so they can get much bigger than this. That's where the growing point is, where a leaf or flower would develop from. And the roots actually also develop from here. They kind of almost encapsulate the corm, and then some roots develop out of the corm as well. This is what Mirage looked like when uh, the corpse flower had a leaf. So you can see the central stem there and what looks a bit like a small tree, but what's really interesting about this is it's actually all considered one giant single leaf. So every time this plant uh, comes out of dormancy, it'll either have one giant leaf or one giant flower. So we're not sure when Mirage will bloom next, but it's possible it could be the next growing cycle or it could be a growing cycle after that, but we'll have to stay tuned and see what happens when she comes out of dormancy. So it's a pretty amazing thing um, and a rare opportunity to get to see what a corpse star looks like underground. Yes, it's quite good.